The British actor has of course kept the details of his role under wraps for the time being, but there may be a big clue hidden in how he described when he got the part. Speaking in a new interview, he recalled meeting with J.J. Abrams and Daisy Ridley, who plays Ray, and being astounded when he was told who he would be playing. So does his role have a big connection to Ray specifically? We'll have to wait and see, but Grant told the Telegraph of his casting process, I got 10 pages of script from a 40s British war film, three scenes in total, and had to video myself doing them on an iPad. Then you send it off, and feel like you're never going to hear anything about it ever again. I got a call two months later to say a car was going to pick me up and take me to Pinewood Studios to meet the director, J.J. Abrams, which was odd, because I still had no idea what he was going to direct me as. He said he was taken to a room with Abrams and Ridley, when he finally learned what he was getting himself in for. I was, surrounded by all this Star Wars memorabilia going back to 1977, he revealed and within about two seconds. Abrams, said, are you gonna do it or not? And I said, do what? Then he described the part, and I think he told me what my name was, at which point the room went upside down. Current theories and alleged leaks put Grant as some kind of general or first order officer, but these are all unconfirmed. Fans are speculating that the title of the final part of the trilogy will be announced in the coming weeks, after The Last Jedi's official name was revealed on January 23, 2017, ahead of its December release. Filming is expected to wrap up in the very near future, pending extensive reshoots. Star Wars 9 is out on December 19.